Blue-collar jobs, like the one Luke Buckingham is training for in this apprenticeship program in Baltimore to become an iron worker journeyman, used to propel people firmly into the middle class. I'm like lower, lower middle class. I made a lot of mistakes, I feel like. I don't feel like it's too late to change any of those mistakes or fix them. Buckingham dropped out of college and quit a steady construction job to follow a girl out to Chicago. They broke up and he came back to Maryland, and the Iron Workers program has helped him get back on track. I'd like to make it through my apprenticeship program, be somewhere maybe more stable maybe, get married, have my own family. I've been working steady for two years, somewhere close to that. And so that's kind of like what I have to go off of right now. And um, every day is a struggle, you know? With a lot of steel work going overseas and increased automation, jobs like the one Buckingham is training for are becoming harder to find. Maybe back when our parents did this, it felt like middle class. And they had a pension and everything with all that stuff. It's coming to a close. And we realize like people don't have pensions and and stuff like that. It's depressing. Like I don't I don't wanna I wanna talk about it, you know. I feel like I don't have the same opportunities like come my way. Nonetheless, Buckingham believes that this is his chance to be successful, to live a comfortable life. I don't feel like the future is bleak or like there's nothing in it for me. Maybe, you know. I just like to, you know. Be optimistic. I'm gonna work as hard as I can until I can't. Buckingham voted for Donald Trump in the presidential election, but he's concerned that Trump doesn't support labor unions, like the one that runs his apprenticeship program. I'm a union iron worker. I'm supposed to be fighting for higher wages, and he's he's hiring people for the least amount of money that he can. Yeah, it's kind of like a bad thing for me. Because the union is such a vital part of our history, why wouldn't you support that? Regardless of his concerns, Buckingham doesn't really think much will change in the end. So he just plans to work hard and hope for the best. I just feel like, you know, it's not all his say, so I shouldn't even really worry about it. Everybody's, everybody ultimately wants the same thing, so I go home at the end of the day safe. I know there's a lot of bureaucracy within our government, which will hold off change. So I'm not really worried about too much.